This next report is about what is perhaps the most terrifying word in the English language, calculus. All right, maybe not terrifying, just intimidating for a lot of students. But not anymore, not at least at a San Jose high school. And the credit belongs to a teacher who is, is, is as innovative as he is enthusiastic. The formula for success from ABC 7's education reporter, Leanne Melendez. His name is Sudhir Karandakar. In Hindi, his first name means boldness. And that's what he wants each student to take with them. So that means we've got to do a little bit of what inside this square root? This is Karandakar's fourth year teaching AP or Advanced Placement Calculus at Mount Pleasant High School in San Jose. Those who pass the AP test automatically get college credit. Four years ago, this class was not what it is today. Before taking over the AP Calculus program, only 47 students had passed the test in a nine-year span. But in one year, Karandakar helped 43 out of 51 students pass the AP Calculus test. His class is so popular, this year 104 students have enrolled. He's very influential for me personally. I mean, the way he teaches and the way he admires each student and he cares for each student. We're not just, you know, bodies in the classroom to him. Karandakar has a degree in math, but before teaching this class, he took his father's advice, also a calculus teacher. He told me to go back to college and take a calculus night class and see how it was from a student's point of view. He also divides the students into groups of four. We can do it too. Just because we're in Eastside School doesn't mean we can't be like the other more prestigious schools out there. If all 104 students pass the AP Calculus test, they will have set a district record. Karandakar is already being compared to Jaime Escalante, the East LA teacher whose work was shown in the movie Stand and Deliver. Ironically, Karandakar says he and another colleague consider Escalante their hero. Our dream was to teach AP at the same school, AP Math, and uh, teach it at a lower performing school like this one and see if we could compete with the top schools and the private schools. That's our big life mission. And um, I think if these kids do what we think they're going to do this year. In San Jose, Leanne Melendez, ABC 7 News.